Hello, all my Yosemite Lakes Community Church peeps out there. How's everybody doing? How are you doing with your New Year's resolutions? How many of you have stayed with it? You got the Christian acronym from last Sunday, and you have the C, the H, the R, each one of those, and you begin implementing them into your life. I would love to hear about those. I'd love to hear how you're doing with those. You can put it on the comments below if you want and give me an update. If you have no idea what I'm talking about with the acronym and all that, I will put a card up here that kind of goes, it's, you can click it and you can go back and check out that sermon. It's on YouTube and it was really good. I liked it, I excited about it. Now this Sunday, I start a new series and I brought, there he is. I brought this Lego. This is one of my favorite Legos. I love Legos. I'm a huge Lego fan. I have a lot of Legos to be honest with you. And this one's in my office um, because my wife gave this to me when she told me we were having our third baby. I, I think um, you're probably asking why. Well, it's kind of like a suburb, uh, an SUV, and it's got a surfboard and luggage. Whoa, almost dropped it. And anyway, so it kind of represents our family's growing. And so it's cool. And so it sits in my office. But I love Legos. And so I have the whole next series based on Legos, and it's called Bill. What we're actually studying is 1 Corinthians, and we're talking about building our life on Christ. And each part of 1 Corinthians speaks to a different part that we're going to be working on. Uh, it's going to be fun. The whole stage is decked out in Lego. I'm going to use Legos as illustrations, obviously. And one other part to that is I think the body of Christ is a bunch of pieces. This comes up in 1 Corinthians that when we work together and we come together and we get rid of division, which is kind of coming up in chapter one, that division, once we get rid of it, we build better things. We build stronger things. A couple other things this Saturday, men's, uh, men's ministries back and we're starting with a breakfast this Saturday. Another thing that's coming up that is very significant is our, our second get to know us lunch. So we have these get to know us lunches throughout the year, only about four a year. And this is a chance to learn about our history, to learn about our plan forward, to learn, uh, meet all the staff and kind of our whole vision of what we're doing here. And if you come to this free lunch and you want to partner, if you want to kind of move forward and I call it get married instead of dating. But if you're ready, if you're saying this church is going to be your home and you want to go all in with it and just say, all right, I'm in. I call that partnership. We're partnering together for God's kingdom. If you haven't been baptized, we're doing that on January 30th. And one other thing to put on your calendar is Super Bowl. We're gonna do a huge party here at two o'clock. The game starts at three, but at two o'clock, we're doing a chili cook-off. So if you want to uh, put your chili up against others, if you're good at chili, I don't know. If you're right. <laughs> I'll see you this Sunday as we jump into the book, 1 Corinthians, and we start building our life on Christ and building our life together and building this church to everything that it could be and can be and is in our world. Can't wait. Look forward to seeing you all this Sunday or this Saturday if you are a man.